It's definitely not something you see every day. It appears a home in Manesson is being held up by ratchet straps. Neighbors say it's a danger to children and others, and they want it taken down. Ross Gadotti's been on the story and has the details. Ross. Kim, Christine, when you take a look at this house, it's absolutely stunning. It literally looks like it's being held up in a spider web of ratchet straps. But as we found out, those straps may not be there to keep it being upright, but in fact, may help it in the demolition process. When it comes to ruins, you have the amazing Leaning Tower of Pisa, the awe-inspiring Colosseum in Rome, and Manesson has this. That house is going to fall in any day now. This home at 9th and Marguerite Avenue is, to say the least, a spectacle. First, it was gutted out by fire, and it's been some time since then. Since December, since around December. But what makes this burnt-out blight an eye-opener is the fact that over the roof, through the windows, and all around, it appears to be being held up by ratchet straps connected to dumpsters. It looks insane. There's no point. I mean, look at it. It's an eyesore, and it's dangerous. There are kids on this street. Having sat for months, the court ordered the building demolished. I spoke to some officials in Manesson, and it turns out the straps aren't necessarily there to hold the building up, but eventually tear it down. I tried to contact the owner of the home as to when the building will be meeting the wrecking ball. I'm awaiting a reply. In the meantime, Tasha Arnold plans on keeping her kids as far away from the structure as possible. You could look at the top of it and see it's not going to be there much longer. That house is going to fall eventually, and I just hope something is done before anybody gets hurt. Now, the homeowner has roughly six more weeks to have it completely demolished. That is, if it doesn't fall on its own between now and then. Reporting live in Greensburg, Ross Gadotti, KDKA News.